Spear here. Whoops. <laughs> right away we're off into space. Well, almost into space. And we're leaving the frosty planet. Frosty, frosty. Chilly cold. Ah, we got a little base over there. But we've been to two of the planets now. We still got two more to go. Looks like that'll be one, and that'll be one. So which one's closer? That one is 2,000 KS. This one is 2,000 KS. That one's a little closer, so there you go. Let's scan it and go. Dead planet. Wah, wah. I thought about going to the space station. Oops, not that. But as you see, we have a lot of free spots, and this is a dead planet, which I didn't know in the beforehand, but since we had a lot of free slots, why not? So let's charge up the multi-tool while we're on our way. Haven't used the uh, bolt caster in quite a while. We'll just pop, pop down here, we'll scan and go. So we'll just be here for a second, and then hopefully the other one won't be too far away, but I'm not sure of the distance. Okay, so we still got another 1,100 and 1,200 clicks. It's going down. I thought it was going down faster than it was. Gold, iridium, heridium. I don't need any of that. Nope. What am I going to do with that? Actually, we, <laughs> we never really need anything, do we? Unless, of course, we use a black hole. Man, when I first played this, I, I used black holes to great effect to get, you know, jump far ahead. But there's really no, well, I guess you go to the center, you get more exciting and interesting things. But I, I, don't, I don't see the, the drive to get to the center. I, I, don't, I don't know. Life's a journey, not the destination. You know, enjoy your, your trip through. Don't just uh, feel pushed and pushed. Uh, a lot of people go on, on like vacations and holidays and they want to do everything and see everything and they don't really get to stop and enjoy things like they should. Well, people can do what they want, but I hear people complaining that they rush too much during holidays, so that's why I say it. <clears throat> you can spend your holidays however you want. Okay, so let's just sit down somewhere. Doesn't really matter where, because there's nothing here. Whoa! Okay, let's... Uh, oh, nope, we're gonna crash. Okay. If we kept going down in that trajectory, we were gonna take a nasty tumble. And I was like, uh, no. Please no. Eerily calm. That's an interesting weather. I haven't seen that one before. Eerily calm. So we could get some of this iron. Oops, did I just scan my ship? Not much iron there, is there? <laughs> Let's at least free the ship from the iron. But there's nothing. Okay, so there is nothing right here. Anything? A little bit, okay. Enough plutonium to take off. Well, we have so much plutonium anyway, but as long as it's here. Always a sense of why they would be here. Nobody knows. There you go. That it? Oh, there's more over there. Let's see if I can get it. Ah, it's going to take a second. Aim. There you go. Uh, aim. Another sentinel. Oh, he's going to investigate. He's going to be coming over here. All right. <laughs> da, 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 da. Let's get out of here. Ooh, you did lose, use a lot of iron there, didn't you? And let's claim the planet in the name of Spearlandia. Is that the one we need to go to right there? Hopefully. Yeah, I think it is.
Yep, cool. So we did, uh, you know, right here. Trading Post, Cactus Flesh, Desert Planet. Might as well land at the Trading Post, I suppose. Ah, uh, let's use that plutonium we just picked up. Uh oh. I am not gonna call anybody. Although I do have those chits that I can get help with. So let's see what we're gonna do. How's this gonna work out for us? These beams, uh, where are they? There they are. One guy. Oh. One guy. One star. Not difficult, was it? Uh, what's difficult is trying to find out where we were going. <laughs> oh, we got two trading posts on the planet. All right then. Took a couple hits, but no problem at all. No problem at all. Hmm. Should I make another warp cell? We'll use a little bit of the phase beam. Maybe I should be using the uh, cannon. I probably should be using the cannon more. Oh, we're landing in the nighttime. That's not going to give me a good view. Unting Kovia. Whoa! <laughs> this one looks a little weird for some reason. It looks, uh... It looks a little weird from the from above. A little more high tech than normal. I don't know why. Dang, that was close to push me over. Ceaseless drought. Relaxed uh, sentinels. Copious flora. Few fauna. So we'll get to sell all the. Uh, things we've been picking up. Oops. I often do that. I often hit scan when I just want to fly. Wow, it's noise. Species scan operational. Hmm, fascinating life form. I know all these words. This is, uh... This is interesting. Request some that another word. Decease. Decrease. Sorry. Scholar entity. How are you doing? Oh, this guy's gonna be the same thing. So I can give him a gift or I can request words. I'm gonna give him a gift. I don't normally do that because I don't really need to. Because <clears throat> my standing with the Corvax is pretty good. Ooh, now it's cold. Alright. Nighttime gets a little cold here. Not really, a little cold. It's a tiny, tiny bit. Nothing found. Come on. You go over there. You go over there. Send all the stuff to the ship. You go to. Oh! Exosuit's full. Oh, okay, so it was, I guess it was cold at night, but now the war mo morning's here, it's getting warmer and warmer. And warmer. And warmer. It continues to heat up in the morning. Uh, okay, so it's not, uh, not going to go crazy, it looks like. Rock. 
fair number of things already, just from up here. I was a little nervous sitting here on the edge. I'm like, I don't want to fall over. Look how high I am. I don't want to fall over. A little afraid of heights up here. One out of six on the species already. I guess I don't need to scan these things now, do I? <clears throat> and we will go down and scan all these things in just a little bit. But they're there, so you scan them. You scan any of that stuff? There you go. So we got a fair amount of credits just from scanning things. A couple hundred thousand, maybe? Well, I don't know if that much, but did all right. All right, let's get away from this place, because this place is really loud. <laughs> Go sell what we've got. <sighs> All right, gotcha. Starship inventory. Uh, rusted metal. Grand team. Crock rock. Nitrogen. Nickel. Frost crystal. Hold on to the antimatter. We don't really need to, but we're going to. I mean, we use the antimatter for... See, now the ship doesn't seem to bounce around when I sell stuff, but the suit does. Use the antimatter for warp cells, but we've got so many warp cells, it's, it's crazy. Alright, so... We can use some iron. That's about it. Okay, there's our ship. Is there anything we can see out there? Darn it. See? Ah... I wish this was a place we could just walk around, but there's, there's nowhere to walk around to. You know, there's, there's no, there's no discoverable, there's no question mark. Of course, you've probably seen something which I've missed. Huh? You might be screaming, uh, "Spear, just go right over there!" But. Uh, I didn't see it. So, see, there's just there's nothing out there. I feel like I'm on Tatooine and I'm just uh, staring out into the desert. But we'll go out. Boy, I wish. See now, look at this. This is a this is a, a cool planet we've got. We're, we're walking on it. We've got no worries. Well. Currently, I'm saying I have no worries, but uh, there's a killer right there. That guy. Volatile insect eater. For some reason, the insect eaters believe I'm an insect. Pardon, coming through. So we do have one uh, naughty species, I guess you'd call it. The insect eaters. Not sure how I got to be an insect, but... That's what happens sometimes. Those guys are just gonna go out and kill everybody. You. That's another guy who's uh, That guy, the little guy's a... Uh, this one has several predators on it. But four out of six already on the species. <laughs> nice. Eight flora. And zero waypoints. Alright, so this guy's coming after me, probably. So I've got to get out of here without being attacked. I think that guy wants to kill me, too. No, he doesn't. But there are so many predators on this, uh... Planet. <laughs> Wherever I go, the predators are just gonna spawn and kill everything. Alright. Yeah, so he goes the predator down there, he'll just kill whatever's around him. 
Do predators kill other predators or do predators only kill prey? And why do insect eaters come after people? Do they just not know I'm not an insect? I think I scanned you, little cactus. No. Nope. So what am I exactly doing here? Or do I know? I could use four more rocks, but other than that, I need two more species. I was hoping one would be a bird so I could uh, get that quickly. I'm sticking to the hills. Hills stand for safety. Well, as safe as I'm going to be. Good boy. Yeah, this is, uh... You look new. Look yeah, that big thing. Four meters tall, vegetarian. It's <sighs> a cool thing. Which means that we're just down to one. We need one species. Let's grab one of these real quick. One. We used up a hundred iron getting over here, so. Let's see, we got five, so I figured. Uh oh, we're running around. Right I, I figured the last. I thought the last one might be a bird. We got all the land ones really. We got all those land ones really quick. I was hoping it would be a bird, just to make it easy on us. No luck. These things are swaying like it's a storm, but there's no storm. But that's, that's twice now I thought things were swaying a bit too much and I got concerned that it would be a storm, but... Ooh. A lot of predators around here. Five out of six. Just keeping them busy. Watch out, we got this guy here, dude. Um, pardon. That guy is a predator, so I didn't mind uh, just kind of stopping him in his tracks there. See that? He just stood there. He couldn't come up the hill. He just stood down there and cried. <laughs> they, they did a good job uh, on these animals. That is exactly what a uh, what an animal, a frustrated animal, would do. Now, what is this storm? That is the question. Birds. There you go, six of six. There's a storm and it's a heat storm. Right. 
Okay, I know there was a question mark right here. Um, we were walking right towards it. We were right there. It was right here. Was that it? Way over there? A minute away? Alright. Do we want to get out of the heat? Sorry. Yeah, let's go ahead and get out of the heat. Get out of the heat, just hang out in here. It's a cool 63 degrees. Look at all those birds out there. Man! How did I miss the birds? But you do recall I said it was a bird. I said, I think we're missing a bird. And boop, there it was. Okay, I won't say that again. Alright, so we got everything there. Got plenty of carbon. I haven't really picked up anything here, Just we just scanned everything. But, oh well, we got our six fauna. We got all of them for an extra 150,000 unit bonus. And another planet uh, complete. And we're going to pass 14 million. Oh, so close to 14 million. 13 million 998,000 credits. That's our friend, the vegetarian over there. Four meters. Or... Er, Maybe it's our friend, maybe not. It's another one of them, I'm assuming they're friendly. Well, we haven't done anything to make them unfriendly. Uh, I was hoping to get somewhere inside, but this is fine. We're not too worried about the heat. Pick up a bunch of goodies here. I do mean a bunch of them. Warp set. Anything else? The grass is kind of tall. Need that maybe later. <laughs> yeah, I feel like we might have missed a couple of these, uh, those little containers because the grass is pretty tall. So. Oh. Probably missed something. Man, look at that. It does look hot, doesn't it? With the heat haze. Ooh, not that. That. To the ship with you. You, but you. Our radio. Oh, I did miss one. See it right over there. The Cancer's staining straight up. Two of them. <laughs> I ran right by them. Were they even there the first time? Come on, how can I walk right by them? Oh, uh, something's shooting me. Hey, right, what? Hide behind the tree here for. Oh, I guess not. Dimensional Matrix. Now I've got to find the two barrels. Ah. Why does that guy after me? Um, did I accidentally hit him when I was, uh... When I was, uh... I think I might have accidentally shot him when I was, uh, shooting at the, uh... Yeah, it doesn't... It doesn't look friendly. Not you. He doesn't look... He, he's... He's volatile. Oh, he's an insect? He, oh, he looks a little different than the other guy, doesn't he? <laughs> so he's walking very slowly towards me. <laughs> Alright. Is 
tell you what, let's just go ahead and call the ship over here somewhere. Where's a good spot to land the ship? Zoop. Zoop. Although maybe I should go back and just sell all this stuff. That's probably our best bet. Run back, sell all the things we just picked up. That looks like it. A little life support if you don't mind. that but where's our ship there you go what do we got four and a half minutes I did not think we walked that long it didn't seem like that long did it well maybe it did all right well we'll just run back that's what we'll do next time we've discovered everything we we're going to discover in this system next time we're off to a new system so join me then thanks for watching hope you're enjoying our trip through the universe no Man's Sky with a Spear. See you next time.